Okay. Prolog 3. Now, tried, of course, many, many different iterations of pulling along the top. None of that worked. So we end up going with uh, sort of a triangle shape on the right hand side here. I don't remember if I was unsuccessful when I had my unit on the fort, or if this was just the first one I tried that worked and I didn't bother experimenting. But in the end, this is what we went with, which allows us to draw in two of the enemies here. Now the Myrmidon can double the Merc, which is good, and also doesn't have to worry so much about hit rates as some other classes might. But I mean, compared to the turns we already lost last chapter, this is all small potatoes. But then we go ahead and we team up for the three-hit co against the fighter with all my scrub brigade. Which leaves my unit to go ahead and finish off the Merc as so. Now, unfortunately, that means we don't draw in anybody yet, but it can't really be helped. Go ahead and give my unit the vulnerability that she'll need. She goes to the fort to draw in the other fighter. I swoop around weapons here so that when Luke baits in Sheeta, he'll be able to be weapon triangle neutral and survive. and just kill that fighter, although if we couldn't, we could have the option of chipping with Ryan to get it done. And then we're going to go ahead, and Luke needs the Vulnery so that he can perform his duty as well. So, once again, it comes down to turn 5. Here we just have Ryan chip away for a nice, hefty chunk. And then we have my unit finish her off. Map cleared. I paused here for a long time because I couldn't remember which option did which, but well, then I just went ahead and decided to mash A.